having whiter and lighter skin is not the only goal of skin lightening having healthy and glowing skin and bright skin is also very very important hey guys welcome back again to my channel i'm so so happy to have you guys back now i have been having a lot of hate going on in my previous video <laughs> and so many comments and also a lot of love from you guys first of all thank you so much for the new subscribers and for the liking my videos for all the support and the love that you've shown me in, the, in my previous video thank you so so much and on that point Please, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed and help me to get to one of the subscribers and let us show these haters, let us pr prove our point to the haters that we don't care, we don't care at all about the negative opinions on our skin and we're going to do what we want to do and we're going to do what makes us happy. Ever since I posted that video uh, on, on my YouTube channel, I've got so many DMs and so many uh, inboxes and messages from all over from many guys for you guys telling me asking me different questions but the main question that stood out was people asking me what did you use that was the main dominant question in my dms and in my inbox and also most people wanted to know how i look like without makeup now before i filmed this video i put up a picture on instagram i don't have any makeup on that photo i'm wearing a sleeveless top so you can see my shoulders as well and uh, the rest of my skin so definitely be sure to follow me on instagram as well without further ado let's just get into the video so today i'm going to be covering the supplements that i have used so far in my skin lightening journey and uh if i was to cover i've honestly used so many supplements and so many products in those four, four or five years that have been bleaching my skin and so i cannot compress everything i have used for the past five years into one video that would be a super duper long video about six hours and no one has time to watch a six hour video so i'm gonna be breaking it uh, up so for now i'm gonna be covering the supplements for today and then uh, later on in the next video i'm going to be covering the creams and the lotions that i've used and then later on in another video i will cover the soaps that i have used so far so the very first supplement which most of you guys already know is butadione now butadione has been widely known for as a skincare supplement for quite some time so butadione is a very very wide topic uh and i'm gonna be covering it much later in a detailed video where i'm gonna be talking about its benefit uh how, the dosage how much you should take according to your weight and uh, how many tablets per day for example and also why it doesn't work for some people and what to do to make sure it works right for you and also how long it will take you to see the results if you follow the tips that i'm gonna give you later on so be sure to subscribe to my channel so that you're notified anytime i upload a video first of all glutadone comes in different forms which is something you need to understand it comes in the oral form that is in terms of the powders and the tablets it comes in the intravenous form that is the injections and then it comes in the topical form that is the creams the lotions and also like the soaps uh, so the most effective of them all and not that will give you more of a long lasting effect and not that will make your skin become extra extra light depending on how light you want to be if you want to be very very pale or very very light the best option is the intravenous one which is the injections so for now i'm just going to be talking about the glutathione products that i have used myself on my skin so the first one as i told you as i showed you in the first video my very first encounter with glutathione was from a guy called michael in uh, facebook he's a filipino guy uh in the philippines so i'm going to put his name somewhere here on the screen so you can uh, go to facebook search, search him up and um, ask him about this product so the particular product i'm going to be talking about uh that michael sold me is a product called Guta power it's a uh, this bottle right here and it uh, contains about uh, 30 or 60 pills and he sold me five bottles and i think one lotion plus i think a soap and it came to almost 26k so i had no issue with his products and his uh, product was working very well for me i was taking two tablets in the morning two in the afternoon and two in the evening and they were working uh, well for me in terms of clearing my acne because at that time that was my primary goal uh, of me taking glutathione i just wanted to get rid of my acne as i told you in my previous video and to have clear and nice and smooth skin so i was taking it like that for two 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 
every day and uh, within uh, about two weeks my acne had cleared like I told you guys and my face was becoming more smoother and my blood sugar were, were fading but because I was very very impatient and I wanted uh, faster results I decided to increase the dosage from two tablets uh, to three so I was taking three tablets in the morning three in the afternoon and three in the evening before I sleep and I used that for almost like a uh, two three weeks uh, and I could two three weeks and within that time I started seeing the results so I moved up like a uh, one or two shades lighter at most it was a visible dis difference it was a visible change and uh, yeah that's how I began with Buta down but now the issue I had with uh, my cost product was that he's all the way in the Philippines so that product has to be shipped to Kenya for me to get it so that means I had to pay for shipping costs that means I had to wait for it to be shipped from where he is to where I am which took almost like a although I used DHL so it was faster but still more expensive in the long run so that was my issue I had with him so because of that I decided to, I decided to go online still on Facebook and to start for people who are selling Buta down here in Kenya that is when I came across my friend Camila so Camila runs these two Facebook pages I'm gonna be showing you on the screen so the first one is called the uh, down for skin Retin in Kenya then the other one is uh, skin the page I first landed on was the first one which is called Buta down for skin Retin in Kenya because that is what I searched for in the Facebook uh, search box so I went on her page, I looked at the reviews of her product and the reviews were good and the before and after pictures and everything was checking out so I decided let me just give this girl a call and see uh, and get more info about the products so I talked to her about the products and that's how I began using them so anyway, to cut a long story short Camila has different products on uh, for Guta Down on her website, on, on her page she has the J1 package, the E1 package, the different packages depending on uh, what level you, of skin retaining you want to get to. And also depending on your goals. Because not everybody wants to get uh, light, not everybody wants to put in their skin. Some people just want to get rid of the acne and have nice healthy skin. And that's, that's what the E1 package is meant for. But you can consult with her further on that. So anyway. The particular package from Camila that I was using at that point was the J1 package. The J1 package has glutathione, it has vitamin C, and it has collagen. They are all powders, you mix them up in one bowl or in one jar, and then you take one tablespoon every day, uh, two actually, one in the morning and one in the evening. That is how I was taking it, and uh, so far I like it so much, however, it didn't give me a, a very fast result. It took me for quite some time to see some changes in my skin so because i wanted to get more and more lighter so i asked camilla about the injections and she was sending them at that point so she saw me this packet right here the glue tax packet this one had 10 pieces of uh, the injections and i was using one piece every month because i was also using the powders as well and i was also using another cream that she had given me to use so by the time I got to the eighth month, my skin was so so light, guys. I was white. I was almost, <laughs> I was almost becoming white, turning white. I was almost getting to Camilla. So when Camilla is actually like people who have seen her would know her skin is very light and also very supple and soft and just all that yummy and gorgeousness. So anyway, as I was saying, my skin became light to the, to the point that at, at the eighth month. I was almost like saying I don't want to finish the, the other two dosages doses because my skin was already so so light so anyway uh, it worked very well for me the second packet I bought from Camila for the injections is this packet right here this is the CRP 10,000 glutax so this is how it looks like so inside it had almost like I think it was 8 or 6 doses so again I was taking but, but for this one it was a higher dosage but because I wanted to get extra light at that point, I chose to use them like I was using like uh, each one dose per week. So they lasted me for almost like uh, I think I think they took me like uh, six about like six weeks or so. Now here's a funny thing, guys. This product worked very very well for my friend Camila, but on me it didn't work. Yes, I know that is shocking. But it's how it is guys with skincare and with skin lightening it could be a hit or miss something could work very well for your friend but for you it might refuse to work on you 
So I was very surprised because when Camilla was using this one, she became so, so light. She was almost actually becoming Caucasian at that point. She was almost becoming white. So, and for me, so I was hoping I'll get a somewhat similar results to her, but it didn't work the same way for me. But I can say you should try it. Uh, uh, that's what it looks like. I can say you should try it and see how it will work for you because different products work, work differently on different people. And on that note, guys, everything I'm going to be talking to you about in this video, guys, doesn't mean that they will work 100% for everyone, but they will work for most people. It's just a matter of try and error and see what works for you. So most of you who have this glitter down, I'm sure you've discovered that it's very very hard to get the original form or the genuine glitter down here in the Kenyan market. But I can tell you for sure, and I'm not saying this because Camila is my friend, but Camila has the best glitter down in the Kenyan market. And her glitter down is not mixed up with other things like, uh, you see some other glitter downs that I'll show you here that I have. They are mixed up with other things, so it's not uh, completely, completely pure. But hers is the pure, pure form of butter down. So I highly, highly recommend her products completely. And most guys who have used her products, they always testify that her products are good. Even guys, who are not, even people who are not her friends or just her customers who I talk to and who I referred to her, they always tell me that they love her products. So I highly, highly recommend her products, and I say you should definitely check her out. Now, another company that I have worked with before here in Kenya who, who sell very nice skincare and skin retaining products is Glam Scott Kenya. Now Glam Scott Kenya, I, again I got to know them through I think either Instagram or through Facebook and they also have uh, very very genuine products. So the, the people who I can vouch for that they have genuine products for skin retaining and they don't only have the down, they also have the creams, the, they have a whole wide variety of uh, skin retaining products so i highly recommend them i'll be putting the instagram link down below another glitter down product that i used from uh glam school kenya was uh the diamond glow <clears throat> i'll put a picture somewhere in the screen that you can see it so diamond glow is almost like the same thing like camera's product it's a powder form of glitter down plus vitamin c I think it has some collagen as well, but what I didn't like about it, first of all, is the sugar content. It has sugar in it, and sugar, if you don't know, but I'm sure you guys know, it's a very big factor in the aging process, and the whole point of glitter down is to make you not age faster. So sugar was doing the opposite effect. So I didn't like the fact that it had sugar in it. Anyway, regardless of that, it didn't work for me. I think Diamond Glow is a kind of product that you need to take several just the product for you to see the results so for me i only took only one jar and honestly it, i didn't see the results it in any case maybe it just maintained my skin color but i didn't see any significant results like even one shade lighter so i think it's a very very good product for you to for maintaining your skin tone or maybe if you're planning to use it use many plan on buying many just the product Still on that note, Glam Spot Kenya sells the OSL uh, Glitter Down. They, it's called the Organic Skin Retainer. And this one I've had so many reviews on it online, even uh, internationally. So many people use it and they swear by it. And it, I've always been wanting to try it and see how it works. And I'll be honest with you, I haven't personally tried it out. But it's a brand called Kenya sells it, and the, and the ladies who sell it are Kenya Zena and Honey. They use it, and their skins are gorgeous. Their skins are so so nice. Anyway, the point is, I highly recommend that you check them out. The only issue I have with with, the, with that product is the price. Uh, it costs. Uh, I think they sell it for fifteen k uh, a bottle. If I'm not wrong. Anyway, just check out with them. I'll put their link down below. As I was telling you guys, it's very, very hard getting the original Gutter Down here in the Canadian market. So, so this, this is the Gutter Down 50mg from Healthy You. And uh, so far, I've been liking it. It's a 3K3, 35 So it's not that expensive. But the issue is because they have, they have only 60 tablets. And uh, considering that you have to overdose on it, doesn't last for quite a long time but for me it's a cheaper alternative to instead of going and getting something fake on the market i prefer to use this one combined with vitamin c so on that note the second supplement i'm going to be talking about is vitamin c so again for vitamin c i also bought it from healthy you this uh 
a package right here they have these big ones and have a small one the big one goes for 19.75 the small one goes for 10.55 make sure you buy if you're planning on resting your skin anyway make sure you buy 1000 milligrams at least the minimum so i've been using these ones in combination with the vitamin uh, with the with the butter down because they work hand in hand together so one of the main mistakes people make when they're taking glutathione is that they don't take vitamin C and if you don't take vitamin C together with your glutathione you're not going to get the maximum benefit out of that glutathione so that's a mistake that most people make vitamin C is a key key component if you're using any kind of glutathione product even in the injections vitamin C is very important so the next supplement I'm going to be talking about is vitamin A again this one I got it from Healthy You it's at 10 1080 this small bottle and uh, I like I like it very much now vitamin A is a must again for anybody who is doing skin bleaching even if you're just using creams alone and you're not using glutathione vitamin A is a key key part of any skin at any process because uh, vitamin A kind of protects your skin how I see it is that uh, vitamin A protects it maintains the integrity of your skin structure in a way that even if you're using any bleaching cream or any supplements for retaining your skin it will make your skin become weak or become you know how your skin becomes thin or paper like or you start having green veins like even for me there's some creams that I use they give me green veins but if I use in if I use them in combination with vitamin A, I get that like, I find that my green veins they're not so visible, they kind of like disappear. So vitamin A is very very important in uh, maintaining the integrity of your skin. The second thing that is important is a collagen. So this is this is a liquid collagen again I bought from Healthy You. Uh, the price was twenty seven ninety five. So I heard that liquid collagen works way much better than the tablets or the powders so i bought this one from healthy you actually to be honest with you guys i haven't tried it yet it's uh, like this so they are all liquid it's supposed to uh, combine it by dip with a glass of water and you take them there are 10 of them so i think i'll be taking one per day and i'll tell you guys uh, how it goes and what i think about them but anyway any kind of collagen that you get is very very important because you know collagen is the main structural protein in your skin it forms a very very key part in your skin to make your skin become big and not become thin because when you're letting your skin when you're exfoliating your skin kind of becomes thin so to make your skin become a bit more thicker and uh, look healthy collagen is important and remember guys having whiter and lighter skin is not the only goal of skin lightening having healthy and glowing skin and bright skin is also very very important you can have light skin which is not bright so the whole goal is to have healthy light and bright skin the next products i'm going to be talking about later on right now are not they're not a must have but they are good to have they are good to be combined with the glutathione and with everything else that I've mentioned. One of them is biotin. Now, most people know biotin mostly for the hair and the nails, but it's also very, very good for the skin. So you can do some more research on it and find out more about it. So, so far, those are the products that I have tried myself on my skin. So the next products I'm going to be telling you about are products that I know work very well for people who have blackened their skin. Now, the first one is called NAC. Now NAC is available in a healthy U as well. I think it goes for almost like 2K, 2K or 3K. So you can also get it at healthy U. So NAC also kind of works like a glutathione. down. It detoxifies your skin. It's meant for removing the toxins and automatically if you remove toxins from your system, your skin automatically gets whiter and lighter. And NAC is also well known for the natural production of glutathione in your body the next supplement is called nag i'm not sure if this one is available in healthy you i'd have to call them and ask them but nag is well known to increase your glutathione levels by up to 30 percent if you use it at a higher dosage something else that nag is well known for it's known for blocking the production of melanin in your skin the next supplement is called msm now msm i have used its lotion which is also very good which i'll be discussing later on when i'm talking about the lotions and the creams 
and uh, but for now let's talk about the supplement now msm is known for the production of philomelanin in your body now philomelanin is the pigment which people who are light skinned normally have in their skin so when that is uh, produced uh, in excess or when uh, it's produced in your body your skin will eventually become lighter msm uh, i'll also talk about it more in detail in another video because there are many things you need to know about msm before you begin using it it also helps in uh fading stretch marks that's something i've also seen about it so if you have stretch marks from uh skin lightening or childbirth or whatever it is uh, MSM is also a good option for you. MSM kind of works the same way also like NAG and NAC. It helps to boost the natural production of glutathione in your body. So there are some other supplements I'm going to be putting here on the screen that are also very well uh, known and highly recommended for people by lightening their skin. They help you have a nice and even skin glow. Now like I said, you don't need all these supplements for you to have lighter like skin. The main main supplements that you need for your skin is glutathione, vitamin C and collagen. Those are the key key components of your skin lightening game. And in any case, why I began with supplements instead of the lotions is because you can easily get your skin light by using supplements alone without ever 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 having to touch any cream and supplements are way much more safer you are way much on, more on the safer side by using supplements than using a skin bleaching cream and there's so many people who i know who have achieved uh, great results by just using the supplements alone and uh, the good thing with butter down and like using creams it gives you an even skin tone from head to toe uh when i was using butter down uh, consistently when i began even my even even my scalp was also becoming lighter it, as in glutathione is just good for having an even skin tone the only issue is the cost but i say it's worth it if you have the money if you have some spare money or maybe just save because i can guarantee you that glutathione is the best and safest and most effective way if you're bleaching your skin and if you feel like it's not uh, adequate in, uh, for you you can always use uh, the injections for glutathione which work even more faster and more effectively and in the long term. So that is all I have for you guys in this video. I hope I have answered your question on what supplements I use. That is all I know about supplements. Of course, there might be many more other supplements for skin, uh, for skin care. But the main ones that are very well known for skin bleaching or for skin retaining are the ones that I have told you in the video today. So let me know if you have any questions. Put them down in the comments below and i'll be sure to reply to each and every comment as i usually do i want to put a disclaimer out that currently my skin is darker than i normally am if i i think i'll put some pictures here on the screen on how i was looking like before i took a break i think i, I took about a two month break from skin lessening which is very very important if you are a hardcore bleacher if you plan to do this uh, in the long term, the long run you need to take a break at least one one month per year you need to take a break from skin listening to give your skin some space to breathe however right now i'm resuming my normal skin uh, lightening regimen so very soon maybe in like two or three months i might become lighter you might see me looking lighter and you might wonder who is this on our screen it is still me but the lighter version of me but i might oh, i might decide to maintain a skin color it depends on I'll, I'll see i'll i'll see how it goes so in the next video i'll be talking about the creams and the lotions that i have used in my skin lessening journey and until next time guys see ya